hello friends welcome back welcome back to the Django project tutorial so in this video tutorial we are going to uh, demonstrate about the project called the inventory management so the basically uh, the inventory management system is developed by using python django and uh, like front end technologies we have used html css and bootstrap and even we have used some of the jquery libraries and all okay so the basic idea of inventory management system is like to keep the track of the all the devices which we have uh, in our system okay so it will maintain the record of the all the devices and everything okay so like whenever inventory we are adding to the system so it will maintain the detailed record about the uh, inventories okay so basic idea of this is like uh, we can perform all the CRUD operations on the this inventory management like we can add the inventories and we can delete and we can, we can update the inventories okay so now we will going to run this program so to run this applications we have to use the command called python manage .py and run server So after running server it will give the link so if you click on that link it will redirect to the home page okay so this is the home page of the our application so this is the nav bar so i have used the nav bar and this is the home and this is a home button so here i am using the three buttons so to, these are the three different models i am using in database so whatever devices we are selecting those device data will be displaying on the screen so this is the home page of laptop see these are the inventories available in my system so i can also perform the like as i explained we can perform the CRUD operations for all the uh, data available on the table so i can add and i can update and i can delete okay see the, these are the available data so now i will show you how to add the uh, data to the database okay so here i am selecting the category as laptop and i am adding data here so okay to click on add type so type is i'm using so i'm adding the laptop okay so select laptop so click on the plus button and the apple type the price of the laptop okay so here uh, the item is available or not based on we can select the options okay if, is there any issue no so just click on add devices okay so it will add to the devices so now click on the this laptop it will show the see apple pro is now i had it. this is the id i am using so it will be generating automatically it will increment okay so this is uh, i'm using in for loop so it will auto increment so i can add and i can delete the operations now if i want to add or delete i can instead of already purchase so i'm changing this okay see available it will now show it will available so if you want to delete you can just click on the delete options here this is the so i found now see this is the available options so this is all uh, like adding the laptop to the inventory so now similar way desktop also we can add okay so we can update and you can add so now i will add one more desktop desktop pc so price you have to enter the price and no issue and click on the add button so it will add so click on the uh, devices see desktop pc i have added it is a cost and you can also update and edit okay so here desktop one i will change name okay see click on the desktop see now it has been renamed so if you want to delete you just click on the dis delete options so similar with mobile like even you can update on it you can insert the so if i want to delete i can delete or if i want to insert just click on the this plus button so it will be going to insert to the database okay i'm adding the mobile okay honor no issue just click on the add button so it will add here see here now i have added this one okay sorry this one if you want you can edit also see so now i will 
show you back end like how back end it will works okay so to see this one we have to log into the admin panel okay so in the admin panel we can see the everything so just log in by the admin credentials see these are the database tables or we can say models so user means this is the it will uh, store the information related to the database user like admin these are the admin user and all okay so here desktop means it is a table so this will store the data of the all the these desktop desktop applications means desktop is the one of the uh, inventory so those inventory data will be storing in this model okay so next laptop and all see these are the similar three models are there we can uh, store the data so like admin can add from here also like now i will show to one how how to add the like devices from the admin panel so now i will add one laptop from the admin panel okay so here type the laptop apple pro one two double one and enter the price and you can select and you can click on the add button so so now it will show app added so now you can go to the laptop and you can observe say the app pro one only has been added from the admin panel okay so from admin panel also we can perform all the CRUD operations and even from the front end also we can perform the operations so this is the simple applications of okay of the inventory management like so all the inventory we can uh, store into the database so basically we are we are using the sqlite database okay so i hope you understand this video tutorial so thank you for watching this video tutorial have a nice day